make the arch form using a canine contouring plier. Actually, uh, for making rectangular uh, wires, you know, you get a turret, which is really very small in the sense like it makes very constricted arch, not what turret you use for uh, labial. This one is very small, you get a turret also. Huh? That is available with OMCO. Or else, you can also use preformed rectangular wires. Okay. Is it fine? Oh. So, you bend the canine premolar inset, gives a canine premolar inset bend. one side I will make the bend for the upper arch and one side I will make it for the lower arch, the canine premolar inset bend. So, that is around 1.5 millimeters from the premolar distal to the second premolar bracket. Okay. Now, you can see this wire for the canine, the inset is more here. Uh, so, the canine premolar for the upper arch, this is for the upper arch, this is for the lower arch. This is less, this is more. This also will depend how much you want to correct. Sometimes, in some cases, you might not have to correct. If you bond, uh, if the thickness is same or something like that or you can give this, okay. <laughs> 
Now, once you have made this wire, <coughs> engage the wire into the typhodon, huh? whether using upper, lower, whatever. Okay, I have engaged this wire. Now, what I will do is, now for this canine, for example, I will put a rotation tie. Okay, so I will take the E chain, power chain I will take. There are two techniques in this. I prefer the first one, what I will show. Okay. Now, you take this, put this ligature wire in one of the, that is at one of the terminal uh, module. Then what you do is, suppose I want to rotate this teeth distal out, this canine. So, what I will do is, So, I will take this E chain below the arch wire and then what I will do is I will put it into the distal. This is one of the terminal end. I will put it into the Okay. Then I will pull it. I will pull it, I will put it into the interproximal area hmm? below the contact point. Then I will put this ligature again on the distal aspect. I will go again below the arch wire. I will pull this ligature out. Okay. Then I'll engage. That is one, two, three, hmm. third or fourth. This is a close up. Karo. I have. Tied it here, this each and I have tied it, taken 
below the contact point as you can see here I taken it below the contact point I taken it again this is from the mesial to the distal I have gone below the contact point below the arch wire then I have engaged one of the module onto the that is from this module 1 2 this is a third module I think so third module I have engaged onto the bracket so what will happen is this e chain this e chain will try to pull <coughs> this out it will try to retract that time the distal will come out it will get rotated the teeth will get rotated is it clear 